What are you going to do with the money, guys, if you win? Oh, gosh. Well, like I said in my interview, <laughs> I'm... You're helping Granny. Yes, I'm helping my grandma pay for those tickets that she... <laughs> Ooh, thank you so much. I wouldn't be here without you. <laughs> and I was also thinking gas is a lot of money. And so to come up and drive to Gabby and see her, like, all the time, if I hopefully can, <laughs> that's going to be a lot of money. So if I win, that's probably what I'd put it towards. I probably spend it on flights so I could travel all over the world and take as many dance classes and as many as opportunities that I can and try to spend more time with Catherine because we live in different countries so I'm gonna try and try and get flights if I could do yeah. that yeah. Do exactly well do you guys you guys have to tonight you had to step out of your comfort zone a little bit and perform with different all-stars was that kind of weird for you guys or how do you feel about that it was weird. I mean, my dance was about adoption, and I was like, how ironic, because Gabby is, like, handing over me for the week to Jenna, so Jenna adopted me from Gabby. So <laughs> it kind of worked out perfectly, but it was it was kind of weird dancing not with Gabby because I'm so used to her, and we have built such a strong connection. But I think Jenna and I, I think we worked well as a pair, and I had so much fun working with her. I was very nervous to dance with Jonathan, especially because I was doing a different style and he's a pro in salsa dancing. So I was super nervous because I didn't know what I was stepping into, but then he's an amazing partner and I know that as the week went by, I knew that I could trust him 100% knew that I was going to be safe in the air when he was throwing me around. So No was, hands. That no, was scary. That was so scary, but he made me feel super safe and it was really exciting. And now, guys, life after the show. I mean, next week this all comes to an end, which is crazy. What is what is going to happen for you? I mean, you go back to school, but is life going to be any different? Well, I think we're going to keep our connections and like we're, we're going to stay best friends. Like that, we've created all these relationships throughout this journey and stay in contact with our all stars and the choreographers. And I think we're just going to try and see what goes on and work as hard as we can so that we can get more opportunities hopefully for sure yeah I just hope this journey opens so many like I hope it opens doors for us because through these doors and through these opportunities we're gonna find each other again in different jobs and that's where we're really gonna get to like know each other even more I mean we know so much about <laughs> each other I mean it's been a long journey but coming to an end I was thinking about it and I was like wow mm -hmm. it feel it flew by so fast and so I almost started crying. I'm like, I don't want to leave. Oh, you don't I don't want to. I want to go back to Canada. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I love it in San Diego, but please, no. <laughs> well, now that the competition's really, you know, heating up and stuff, how do you guys pep talk yourselves before going on stage? I think at this point, we've, we've established that we've gotten this far and we should be proud of ourselves because this was the last competition and we've done what we can and we've worked as hard as we can so it's really out of our hands at this point so I think next week we would just really have to give it our all because it, it's going to be the last time we perform on that stage and we want to make it a good one. Oh, yes. oh yeah. I think we just need to like soak up every minute <laughs> of it and when we get on that stage just enjoy it because if we don't enjoy it we're going to be like that was our last performance and we're, I'm not happy with it and yeah. you never want to feel that. So exactly. like Gabby has been telling me just enjoy every moment and I think that's what we're going to do and that's what we've been telling ourselves. Yeah, absolutely. Well, guys, thank you so much for talking. Good luck next week. Thank you.